I love nature and nature has been into my life for a long time. Today I'm at this place and I want to show you what's happening in this river. I wasn't aware that this river still exists but I love how things are over here. Indeed it's a nice waterfall on that side. This is the nature of the world and I love how water runs here. It goes passes under the this kind of bridge and it's so nice and very very warm. Someone might ask Moses why do you love nature? You know nature is life and nature is everything. very calm man life in africa sometimes we really enjoy it and i choose to be in the village because of this kind of wonderful and amazing moment at least to enjoy the real nature in the world as you're watching this video guys beginning from right here let's support by subscribing and sharing and today we have amazing topic that's gonna come up in the next few minutes guys Stay tuned, sit back, relax, and switch on your phone. Draw your tea as you shape your tea. Enjoy this amazing story, very interesting story that you're going to bring it right now on this video. Enjoy and much love. Hello, beautiful people. How are you doing? It's another beautiful moment, and we are coming live from East Africa, Kenya, over here. This is your boy, Moses 2M, an amazing much love from each and every corner of the world. And guys, thank you very much for watching this video again today because you've been watching it. Maybe you watched it yesterday, you watched it the other day, but this is another beautiful moment. I take this opportunity just to welcome you all again into the house. Guys, thank you very much, and most welcome to our, our video for today. If you're watching this premiere, I know you love it and most welcome and thank you very much. Sit back, relax and enjoy. I want you to talk about something here so amazing and interesting. But before we do anything, take a moment and understand this. Uh, there's something that's going on. It's good. We cause on, we correct and also we forward them. You know, that's the main reason as to why we are here. I always say this, when someone's going wrong, it's better you tell them the truth because all of us, these people are our friends, these people are our fathers are our brothers and sisters the best thing is to come loud and say it and something is in our body corner let's make it a very good let no one enter in the fire without knowing the direction right here i am guys and today i want us to talk about something yesterday you were talking about this uh woman who decided to talk about imaginations about giti riba but today i want us to talk about things why it's only i am marwa and the family that's the topic of the day today um you know i'm here and i'm trying to find a position where you can do a very nice video and the nice live uh, video that will stream very clear you know the position guys let me tell you i've walked very far from where i'm, I'm staying in this uh, town over here to this place because i wanted to have a real a video next to a place where it's very cool a very calm and warm place but guys thank you very much welcome and again and again let's begin it right here and let's throw it away let me show you a very nice forest over here i don't know if it's visible do you see what's happening here it's a very nice forest i just love how it is let me try to zoom nowadays my phone isn't clear on camera but I'm just trying my best, my best. This is a very nice forest, and I love the view that's going on on this side, you know. It's a very cool and warm, very welcoming view. Uh, guys, thank you very much for watching, and um, as you are still watching this video, I should I start here. I hope it brings a nice video without, without rain, you know. Uh -huh. The sun is from this side eating me thoroughly. So where should I be? I'm finding the position to sit, the position to do the video man i don't want the ray on this camera do i need a very at least a clear and better camera and clear and better videos here uh thank you guys so let me sit somewhere here at least we talk because you know this place belongs to other people or i don't think that let me just sit here 
let me just try to sit here uh -huh. yes this now better yes so guys uh, the reason as to why i'm doing this video today is uh, about uh, these guys called their set themselves reactors they have been reacting too much on one person neither we have a lot of people doing the same thing that this person is doing and now I have a big question to my audience and also to them and guys if someone is watching this video kindly take a moment and forward this video to them so i want this video at least to reach them so that they know that they are doing what's purely wrong and it's not good it's like someone who hates you but they want to fight you indirectly and that's the truth of the matter over here i want us to talk about um, these people uh, we have this guy called this woman called am carol we have modesta we have masubo one we have uh, there's this guy this guy this guy this guy I'm forgetting the name this gang know themselves and you guys also you know them you know these guys has been doing a lot of things on Ayam Marwa and the family and then they they try to guard themselves or to prevent prevent themselves that these guys they do reaction videos on everything that has been is being posted on the internet but i'm wondering what you, do you mean guys uh, you are trying to say that you are doing the videos on everything that has been posted on internet and yet you are only on one person. We have, how many YouTubers do we have on the, this, this, this world? Mark you. Have you ever seen anyone talking about Wodemaya, Miss Trudy and other people? No one. It's all about on Dimwango, Ayamarwa, David Jr. and then Tanya Boanze. My question is, does it add up? And how does it have the add up? Does it make sense, guys? I really hate this. This thing has really been hitting me. But today I have to expose it out. If you have a problem with me, why don't you come and approach me and tell me, Moses, you are doing this and this very wrong. I don't like this. Do this. Why? It's very simple. Then, trying your set, hiding yourself that we are doing reaction videos. But... Always your reaction videos will be negativity. Negativity, guys, negativity. Why that? When Ayamaro Rocio lost the phone other day, people are on it. That's what they are want. They, they want. When you do something good, they want to turn it to be in a bad position. But does this the real does it make a real sense? So guys, my message to you is guys, you better start doing something that's right. Because these guys you're talking about, especially Ayamaru and the family, if right now we can call you on a panel and tell you guys, I want each and every person to tell me what they, were, what they have done to the community. Guys, I'm pretty sure that no one will, will, will do that. No one will be able to announce and to tell us whatever they have done among you team. Because these people have really done a lot of things that you have seen. Uh, let me just talk about Ayamaru the same way you used to do. This thing started happening. Uh, back then, these stories were, wasn't there. But nowadays, it's too much and it's there. I'm wondering. Because, guys, I want you to take this analytic and, and learn about this. Because if you check on their channel, all these channels are new channels. In fact, no one has got, has got over 20k subscribers. No one. But all of them, we are just around 10, 8, 2, 1 three five you know but i'm wondering myself if you are this what you have been doing since then but why are you not growing because if i want to react on me if you want to react on me i think you need to start from the day i'm starting you also start it so that we grow together like uh, right, right now dim one is at four hundred thousand i am aware it is at five hundred thousand where were you by that time when they began their, their videos Ayamaro is right now seven years old on YouTube. Where were you when Ayamaro was one year old? Why are you coming up right now to start doing reaction? Is this the time that you realize that this guy is doing wrong things? And again, let me ask you. I'm pretty sure that maybe you were not even aware of, of about, you were not even aware on Ayamaro whereabouts and everything back then. But why now you turn out and starting to do videos about him? I need my switch, guys. They are nowadays old, <laughs> but anyway, 
it is what it is. I want to remove them because this is a place where now we get the real and fresh hair, you know. See where I am? Yeah. I'm here just to do get a real and free fresh hair. Yes. So, even here I want you to listen to yourself and think about it. Why building, building a grudge between you and people whom you may need tomorrow? But let me ask you. If you are only doing videos, reaction videos on Ayamaro and David Jr. and D. Mwango and other few people around the village, of which when you are doing video about them, you must connect them or you must attach Ayamaro or D. Mwango. For example, we are very many. We are very many YouTubers. During the party, I came to realize that we are, we are very, very many YouTubers, not few. We are over 100 YouTubers. From Inyabuanze, over 100, guys, that's the truth. People who were there during the Ayamaro party, they were over 100 people. But let me ask you, guys, out of 100, you can only see few like 10 of them. Do you think even Mosa Siaka, I can do something wrong? But if I do something wrong, is it a must that you must uh, correct it here? Uh, if you must correct it, fine, it's your job. But is there any day that I've done something good that you should come out and appreciate that and say this was so good? You know, we have negativity and positivity. We have both sides. We have a uh, side... Um, a negative and positive side. So guys, let me tell you this. Just know you are doing a wrong thing. You are truly doing a wrong thing. And don't expect Ayamara to come out from where he is to do a video answering your questions and answering your reactions. It will never happen. It's now other people like us to come out and tell you the truth that you are doing a wrong thing. Even though you know that you are doing a wrong thing. Today I was watching this girl by the name, uh, I don't know, Carol and whatever. And is really proud, trying to be proud, and yet in your heart you are not proud. Making money through someone's name. Let me ask you, when in case now they stop YouTube, whom will you talk about? Will you be jobless? This is a question you should ask yourself. Will you be jobless? And if it's a must, you must talk about my name. What? How does this concern someone? In a very little mistake, people turn out to talk about and to do videos about it. Very poor and very bad. I don't hate it. We have a lot of people. Guys, if you're doing this, if you know that's your niche, find a way to do it. Not only on one person. It's get bored, by the way. It's now boring. It's not adding up. You better find a way to react on everyone. If you are your, your videos react, react about everyone. And again, you need to know that there's a law. No one allows, especially me, you, you know, no one allows me to come out and talk about bad about someone's name without their notice. No, 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 no. Thou shall not do that. And I think the only thing you should do is to be thankful because this guy has really given you chance enough and enough. Getting deep into someone's family. I wish it could be me, man. Then I could take another position. Very serious. Very serious. It's not good. It isn't good at all, at all, at all. And even you guys, you know that. But anyway, that guys, this was the message of today. That you, reactors, you call the yourself reactors, you better change and start doing something that's constructive to you. This thing will one day land you into troubles. Trouble. Because you are doing it, and on a video, there's a very big and clear evidence. You are saying what you are thinking about me. You are laughing about someone. You are laughing that he lost his phone. Now let's request people to buy. True, when I have a problem, when I broke my leg today, I have to say, I have to tell my audience, because I used to say always that you, our audience, you are our family. You are our, like, immediate family. Or which, in case of anything, I must let you know. That's the reality. So I cannot be in pain, then I keep quiet with that. I have to come out and explore it and let you know that this and this happened to me. Guys, that's the reality and that's the truth. So if you're watching this video, guys, and you know one of these reactors, forward, forward this video to them and let them know that we really don't like this. You are our friends, you are our brothers and sisters, but you, what you are doing, it's totally very, very wrong. Very, very wrong. It doesn't concern you. And even if I'm doing something wrong, you need to get out and tell me, Moses, this and this is bad. But without that, we're running out of the niche. You are running out of the niche. Because very soon, you'll realize that if this will stop doing YouTube, then what will you talk about? What will you talk about? When we were at the party, it was about all about the party. That this thing happened, this thing happened. I am Maro has really helped a lot of people. We have seen our Maro is paying people a lot of students. 
building houses. And you, you are not even buying a suit for someone, just a, suit, a pair of suit or slippers for someone. And that you are there having a lot of things, uh, bad things towards you. I think you need to just know that you are cursing yourself. Your generation is coming behind you. And this thing is going to affect them without you knowing. I'm telling you the reality and you are here to bring the reality, reality about life. You know, I, let me just say I don't deal much with the reaction videos. But sometimes we need to correct some things. The truth of the matter is that. Because when you are doing something wrong but no one comes out to tell you the truth, then later you start crying, I wish I knew. But it's good now you cry, you wish you knew, but you were told about this. The truth of the matter is, you need to change the style and you need to change your movement. Without that, it will land you into a very bad corner. Otherwise, guys, if you're watching this channel, thank you very much. Subscribe, like share and don't forget to comment the video is still going on and i just want to walk out to show you what's happening now in the world once we have corrected everything we get out to explain and to show you what's happening in the world because we are here to explore and also to create awareness about how things are working over here i'm feeling super good i'm happy and thank you very much my audience for this great support you have been growing with me and you are growing road to 5,000 subscribers and it's gonna work by the end of the next month i'm pretty sure it might be somewhere there so guys let us keep on supporting each other because you are here for growth. Guys, just think, if you, are, you can be in a family and you are supporting each other, you can grow so fast and very high. And guys, you reactors, if you want things from my Amarwa, approach this guy, he will do it for you. For free. Because we have this experience and we have seen it. So that's the truth and that's the matter. So guys, thank you very much. Let's continue doing other things. I want to walk around to show you what's happening over here. And I hope you're going to love it. Enjoy this video. To the next level, much love from Moses 2M, East Africa, Kenya. Let's proceed with the video. Amazing and boom. I have this message for Christmas list. We saw a post you post mentioning four guys who stand with you during your hard times. And then you say that other people ran away. Christmas list, please be appreciative. I remember people were really fighting about you. With, with you being released from the jail. And even me, I saw a lot of posters and comments. People were sharing over here we vote for Chris to be free. Please, Chris, be appreciative. Don't say that YouTubers ran away. YouTubers were very active. And even those who could manage to reach there, they were there praying for you to get out of jail. Just know that this is not the last time. You never know. So please just be appreciative. When you get out, they say thank you everyone for your amazing support and everything. But don't just say that YouTubers ran away during your hard times. It's not that way. And it's not adding up at all, at all, at all. At all, at all, at all. No one ran away. I see people, someone was saying like Dim Wango ran away from hell. No one ran away. You know, you don't, don't expect that someone is now a big YouTuber and when you are in trouble, they must chip in. They must also be in another condition that will not allow them to chip in during your troubles. And these days to say that, let me solve my problem, then I solve yours. So please, I don't know how it is, Chris, but if this true, you write out that thing on your uh, post, then you post it to your community kindly. We withdraw that. It's not a good thing. It's not a good thing. People, even young YouTubers, people who haven't reached even a thousand subscribers, stand out just to pray and also were asking God to give you a moment to get out of jail. And then you are there now saying that YouTubers ran away. It's not that way. And to me, this is my strong message to Christmas. At least let's be good people. Let's be appreciative. Learn to say thank you when things went well. Learn to say thank you to those who stand with you. And this is a great news, strong news to you. You better understand this. A young YouTuber now trying to correct on, the, on you this. I know I'm young, but know that. In mind, I'm big. So kindly, Christmas list, let's take a turn. You did wrong thing. In case you can write that YouTube has ran away, but I saw even our in our platform and the groups uh, within, uh, in Kenya over here, your comments or your post is was everywhere. People were praying, let Chris be released. People were voting and doing a lot of things for you. And later you come back to say that they ran away. It's not a good thing and it's not a good picture. For our audience, we are here to stand with each other together. 
that's the truth of the matter and we are so loving people I, that's the time i came to realize that youtubers really love each other it wasn't a must that you dim wango was supposed to come and stay with you in jail no the only thing is maybe they did something but you might not know so do research before you do all these things they maybe they prayed for you that's a very big support so don't expect that i must be there physically it's when you see that i really support you let's enjoy this video guys live from the beginning to the end Beautiful waterfall. This is a nice waterfall, man. The nature of the world. Yes, guys, so finally, again, back. Uh, we are ending this video of the day. But before we end our video of the day, because they are getting the right decision now. Oh, not right decision, sorry. Uh, we are getting to the end of the video today. And uh, just, I'm going to say something over here. You know, it's very important, but some people mostly do know it. This message should go mostly to men like us over here. If God blessed you the family and God blessed you with the children and you become a father, kindly guys take it so serious. And the only thing you should do invest in your people. So that when one time will come and you'll be down or you'll be old your people will now give back to you freely and in a very good way but if you don't invest in them and your time comes you'll find it so tricky and in a very very hard condition and there's a reason as to why i'm saying this you know uh, always when people are beginning life there's, there's dogs over here and it's like they've felt there's some stranger passing by that's why they're making that kind of noise Security so tight over there, man. People are very careful. Security must be taken so serious. Yeah, so guys, the, what I'm telling you is that the only thing you should do, you know, someone told me one day that invest in people and in church. <laughs> Not in church, in building a church here. Yeah. So invest in people. Why do you invest? How do you invest in people? By giving back to the community. And who is the community? Uh, obviously, we all know that the community people starts by you, your family, and your uh, friends and other people around your community. Guys, this is where I'm staying. I'm heading over here. In this house. Here, right here, yeah. Yeah, so invest in people and invest in church. I've been seeing a lot of people. Uh, so in my area, people used to grill sugar cane, guys. And it used to happen this way. During working on labor, these guys will take a family, a father, mother, and the children. They go to the farm, they dig. They do everything in the farm, and things get better. But it stands after harvesting. The money comes. You'll realize the husband will do this. This is what the husbands will always do. Uh, the husband will come. They'll go for other wives. Or... If they don't add a wife, if he, have, he has one, one wife, he'll go for another one, they become two or three, because the man is already, already there. Or they will go away, get lost for some one month or two, then they come back with nothing at all, nothing at all, nothing at all. So it always happens that way. It's something that I've seen my, with my eyes. But so this thing is to happen. You find a woman struggling with the children until they go to school, they get big, they be people, and after that, they now start maybe earning 
then this guy will turn to come and start requesting them because it's already down and now he's starting blaming them you are my children you need to support me blah 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 blah, blah. but when this guy sees in the real sense to find that you are in a better position to support your family but you did not do that i'm sending this message to our men fellow men i'm a man also because i'm a father you know the only thing we should pray to god give us this gift of taking good care of our families at all costs i'm praying that god if god blessed me today guys i always say this i want my daughter to be in a position that he she can manage every wealth that i'm having i don't know at which age but i want at least when she gets uh, to understand things i'll start training her in different ways and different things the same apply to the mom me my wife knows everything about me including the, the bank account them the pins and everything she knows you know and this thing i'm just doing them so that i become open to them they understand me then they know that daddy today daddy have or today daddy does not have and it's very good you might not see it today but it's not long you know these things come so fast but no one will come to understand or to realize that these things come so fast you know if you misbehave with them today just know that tomorrow or a time that comes they also do the same to you so it's something that we need to be much careful about you need to be much much careful about uh when god bless you you are in a position where you are, you are working and earning money please divide this money equal with your family take the educate them or take them to school give them food give them the real basic material that they need so that when time comes they will learn to know that daddy really stood with us and daddy has really supported us what do we do to support daddy i've been seeing a lot of people who tried in to invest in their children without getting lazy nowadays they are in a better position they are they're growing the, the things are very okay in their homes peace is everywhere because they invested in their children and right now their children are there to give back to them there's nothing better like that one where your children will now take you to go to out you go out they give you the best food you want they give you medical attention and everything guys that's the most best life that's why i'm telling you do not try to invest much today for your benefit and others but invest for your family so that when they grow up when everything comes successful you are now down they know very well that daddy and mommy did this to us and now we need to support them fully guys that's the best moment ever just let me know like i'm now at like uh, the way i'm 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 in my 30s let's say that when i get to 60s i'm now getting old i cannot do videos but my child or my children will be in a position to do their things to go to work and to feed us me and my wife take us out give us the best reception that you want and the best care that you want guys that's the best moment that's when you will say that you have achieved it but if you try to achieve it today and yet your family is sleeping without food i'm telling you my friend you are going nowhere i've seen this and this is true that's why we are opening on this challenge and to let you know we educate to empower and to entertain our title is to educate to empower and to entertain the reality is that let's say it out let's go to people because i'm pretty sure about that someone may be watching this video a friend of yours is doing the same thing that i'm trying to narrate over here guys advise them to try their best and to change and to change uh you know it's evening and the vehicles are now passing too much over here this why when i say i'm finding a place where it's cool to do my videos is because of noise from the road and love of movements up and down you know there's a very very big route i love how the sun's getting out from that side yeah so that guys uh that's the truth and i'm just going to end this video right here maybe because i don't see it getting so clear and uh, then let me just say thank you guys thank you very very much for this great and big support madera chini tie abiro kawo na pesa di ko na chuk ma mu bar no eh ero mar mi ario no wa mba i see selling fish and today we want to eat fish i'm <laughs> I'm asking her how do you sell how much is it because I need to go to the house and uh, come out with my carrier bag to come and buy it at least for our dinner today. Okay, so guys, uh, right here I'm going to end this video but thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for the great support. You are my best team ever and may God keep Eh? Yeah? Sawa, sawa. <laughs>
there's some uh, someone is saying that you send those guys to send thousands. You know, people believe that when you are talking on phone, when or also when we are doing this video, they just know we are talking with the wife. And there's this belief in Kenya that people believe that the UK, if once you are a white one, you have money. This is the big, big, big mistake. Our big African people believe that once you are white, whites have money and they really respect you a lot. But anyway, you, I love how to really respect the whites, man. I don't know if I come to UK, will I be respected the same way? You're like, hey, this guy has money. Do not touch that guy. Do not try, you know. Anyway, guys, thank you very much. Let me go home and let me stop this live stream right here now and enjoy the video. Let's meet on the next video tomorrow. Amazing and much love. Thank you from Moses to Miss Africa, Kenya. Much love and great support.